Hi, welcome to the making a 2D game in Android tutorial. So, today I'm just gonna show you how to set up Android Studio so you can get started. And uh, for this tutorial series, all you have to do is follow my directions. And um, you'll have a completely working 2D game that you can put up on the Google Play Store by the end of this. You can be completely retarded and not know anything about Java or programming if you just follow me. But of course the more you know about programming and Java the more you'll get out of this tutorial definitely. So, because I won't be explaining every single thing. So first we're gonna have to download the Java developer kit called JDK. Here and uh, you're gonna click this one. 64-bit version. Accept the license, click it. I already installed it, so I'm not going to, but the link will be in the description. And uh, after you download that, you're going to download Android Studio here. And uh, I already downloaded this, so uh, yeah. Then what we're going to do is, once you have both of them downloaded, and go, you're going to go find where you put the JDK when you installed it. So for me it's here, program files, Java, right there, JDK. We're going to copy the address as text and then go to system properties, advanced system settings, environmental variables, and we need a new variable here. We're going to create a new variable I already have it here, but it's going to be called Java Home, and you're just going to paste text address of your JDK here. Okay, okay, okay. And once you set that up, Android Studio should be good to go. So once you're in Android Studio, we're going to go to New Project, and we'll call this My First Game. And your company domain. Um, I don't have a domain or a company, so I'm just putting my name.com. You're gonna go here and you're gonna make sure it's set to API 8, the minimum SDK. Next, blank activity. I'm gonna start with the blank activity. We're gonna name this activity game, just game. And we're gonna hit finish. And now we're going to go to, now it already comes with a hello world written here and a blank activity. And that's called a text view where the hello world is. So we're just going to run this on the Android emulator. And the emulator is notorious for being pretty slow. So just just be patient. And I already have an Android virtual device. You might not, or you might already have one. But let's pretend you don't have one, so I'll delete this one. And I'll create a new one. And uh, let's just choose... This one's good, Nexus S. Latest API. We'll name it Test. And when we start testing the game, we want to test it on a bunch of different devices with different screen sizes and densities, just to make sure it works on all the devices. But for now, we'll just have this one. Okay.
so this is taking a while. So while we wait for this, um, why I'll just go over why I'm making this tutorial. Um, I wanted to learn how to make a game in Android, and I had to go to a bunch of different places to find the answers to my questions. So I'm trying to make it a lot easier for people. In the future, they can just come to one place, one YouTube series that sort of puts everything together instead of searching a bunch of different sources. And there we go, and we have our little menu here too. So um, thanks for watching. In our next episode, we're going to set up the basic game loop.